Sydney had Melbourne's monthly rainfall in just half an hour today. The torrential downpour caused a house to collapse. Roads were flooded, making life hazardous for drivers and pedestrians. A bit wet today. And just a little bit. It's like I don't even have an umbrella. 17 residents were ordered out of an apartment building that was in danger of collapsing. Jane Bunn joins us now. Jane, such a contrast to the delightful weather right here in Melbourne. Absolutely, Mitch. Yet people sometimes think that it rains more in Melbourne. Sydney actually receives double our rain, but they often get it all at once. We started the day on 15 and shot up to 28 in that bright sunshine. Now that is 10 degrees warmer than yesterday when we saw the rain. Onshore winds are keeping it dreary over Gippsland and producing Sydney's deluge, while skies cleared up for the rest. Our winds increase this afternoon as the isobars squeeze together with a high moving past. There is still a lot of tropical activity in the northwest, but for the first time in quite a while, there is no link through to the southeast. And that allowed us to become sunny. Today is historically the hottest day of the year. Year, when you count through all of the data going back to 1855. It's also the day of our hottest temperature on record, 46.4 set on Black Saturday. Now we've warmed up, but there is heat on the way, both during the day and overnight too. I'll have more on this soon. Mitch.